joined by Kieran and Will. Keep it short and sweet. No bad language or nothing. Yeah. What do you think of Gucci online? Gucci online needs to go. Needs to set up. Take whatever he can. Right, he's not showing his face. He's taking loans out in the club now. He's putting us in debt. He's ruining what we. Everybody, else. That's it. We're just going to call it. Anything yeah, else to add? You know what I mean? He's took what, twenty-five million. Yeah. yeah. Give us. Twenty-five million out of the club when that can go on. Back with his players. Anything like that. We're in the position we're in. Give us an up the Albion, lads. Up the Albion. Up the Albion. He's joined by Mo, who's been at the protest today. What do you think of Gucci and Lai? He's ruining the club. He's been here for how long now? A couple of years. He's been here and he's literally, year by year, the club is going down, the club is falling apart. And uh, as you can see by everyone else being here, you can tell they have the same reaction as everyone else and they're thinking the same as us. So, what do you want to happen now? We need him to get out as soon as possible. We need change. You can see with the new, um, the new loan, look at it, he's not paying it back the loan, was it? His third payment, his third time he's missed it. First one was back in the summer. Now again, uh, he's been delayed another time back into the new year. If, if he keeps going like this, he's not going to lie. Give us, sum him up in two words. All right, guys, joined by the lads from Action for Albion, all three of them before the videos, like you even hear from them. I just want to say thank you, you know, on behalf of me and the rest of the fans because we needed something like this. And the fact you stood there and you've organised all this is a, you know, a compliment to the club. Thanks for supporting everybody that's turned out in numbers. You know, let's go again. So, yeah. so, so what is Action for Albion about, in case anyone doesn't know? I mean, there was, there was, there was loads here tonight, yeah. but just so explain it a little bit. Being planned, structured, peaceful in everything that we do. We felt at the time, six, eight weeks ago, when we launched this, that there was needed to have a voice. The fans need to have a voice. We're fed up of being treated like muppets, to be honest with you, by the club. The disdain. Yeah, the disdain. Yeah, it's complete disrespect. I mean, this club is one of the founding members of the league, and we've had 20 years of consecutive Premier League money, so... How in the world that with one season that we might might not need have Premier League money next year, we've got to go and so get a £20 million loan. So we just need to know where the money's gone, really. It's just an absolute disgrace. So, when is he paying back his loan? Yeah, we need There's to, loads we, of stuff in there. We just feel that we need some structure to bring all the Albion fans together yeah. peacefully, as Ali says, and, and to push forward, really. Um, you know, we've getting lots and lots of media attention, which is absolutely necessary. And it's the only way we're going to invoke change. Yeah. Um, you know, the Chinese contingent today was there was nobody here. Uh, normally, it's 15, 20 in suits, invited guests. They're not inviting the guests now, so they've got the message that uh, they're perhaps not welcome anymore with yeah. the with the activities that they're doing. And, and hopefully that leads to change. And, and sending the message to get to China. Absolutely, Paul. And I think I think the I think that one of the things that I wanted to say really to everybody, at Albion fan. I'll be honest with you. I'm more, more more worried about this than these two guys. How we conducted ourselves today, very yeah. to the exemplary, rest of the Albion like, fans, absolutely word. fantastic. Yeah. We begged and begged and begged, please, 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 be as peaceful as we can. Well, it shows that it shows as well that you you know you're leading and people are listening Hopefully, to you, yeah, which is good. So me. like I've I've saw like the shine the light and everything. Yeah. Have you got what else have oh, you got yeah, planned? Got stuff, man. Just keep watching the followers, keep following us Twitter and Facebook. Just keep building that. We got we had we've grown 800 followers in three days, have we or four yeah, days? And, 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 and we've got TikTok channel now with yeah. fourteen hundred. We've got the under twenty ones. So, so um, yeah. where can we find you? Like, just in case. Right. On Twitter, Action for Albion. That's the number four because Elon Musk banned the first one. So, Action for Albion with the number four. Dave looks after Twitter. Uh, sorry, Facebook. Facebook. Uh, and He's Albion for Action again. Action for Albion, for, uh, and then TikTok's Action for Albion as well. All, yeah. all of the handles are the same. Instagram's exactly the same. So, I just really thanks everyone for your support. Everybody tonight has been brilliant. So, oh. we will get to the bottom of it all. Yeah, we're we going. I know you will. I believe in you guys. Part of the work, part of the work going on behind the scenes. Go behind believe me, scene. believe me. I had it before we started this. Like the amount of stuff we need to do, and we worked hard to do it. So, well, we che cheers, guys, and thanks very much. I'll leave the link in the description, guys, yeah. to check it out. Cheers. Not that they'll need much so they've got a lot of followers uh, yeah, on their yeah. side but cheers guys yeah, Liam been to the protest today what do you make of what do you actually make of Gu Chan Lai um, he doesn't care about the club I think he's just using it as like he's a, a, a toy and he can just uh, take money out when he, th when he feels like he pleases uh, he knows nothing about this club it's history it's nothing at all it's like you said the other day it's 144 years old this club you know I think the people who made it have seen it nowadays with what this owner is doing. I think they'll be turning over in the grave because I think he's an absolute disgrace, this owner. Well, if you could sum, in, sum him up in two words, what would they be? Keep um, it clean. <laughs> well, I've got a word, but I've put 
shit owner. <laughs> Jonathan, what do you actually make of Gucci and Lai? Been well, to the protests. How long you got? Uh, <laughs> make it about 30, 40 seconds. 30, 40 seconds. Um, he doesn't give a damn about this club and its history. You know, he's uh, just siphoned money out of it to fund his other businesses. Um, the fact that when he first bought the club, he wasn't allowed to invest in it, uh, I think he's wrong anyway. Um, and, you know, it's just, it, it's really frustrating that deadline after deadline has been been and gone. And basically, you know, like the protesters said, where's the money gone? If you could sum him up in two words, what would it be? If I could sum him up in two words. Um, I, I, I really don't have two words for him. I've just got one word and that is disgraceful. So absolutely disgraceful. Darren, what do you actually make of Gu Chen Lai? Worst owners the Albion would ever have. And uh, give, sum him up in two words, if you can. Stupid idiots. Would you, what do you want to see happen? Do you want him gone? Yes, definitely.